Hi guys, it's Brooke. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I'll be filming a dorm room tour of my dorm at the University of Arizona. Um, I just moved in in my last video, which was my first YouTube video. If you haven't watched it, go watch it. Um, I basically was just showing you guys, um, me and my family just going around to different stores, buying things. And I told you I'd give you guys hauls, but I decided just to make a video of my furnished dorm and to tell you where I got everything. So you guys, if you guys need anything, you can go and buy it. But um, so yeah, so if you haven't subscribed, subscribe to me and help me grow. That would be awesome. And leave a like if you guys like the video and I hope you guys enjoy. Bye. Okay guys, so I just wanted to explain really quick about my room situation and how I got this room and was this my initial room before and everything. So when I applied to University of Arizona, I applied really late. I applied maybe like mid-April. So that was, people were applying from the year before. So my housing selection was very, very late compared to many people because they applied earlier. So when I was applying for housing, the housing options that I had were very low. Like there were a single bedroom that was like this big in a not so great of a dorm. And so my dad, I had to choose it because that's, I had to get some sort of living for at least the first year. So my dad wasn't very comfortable with like me living by myself, going home by myself. And I don't know, he just wasn't really safe with it, especially since I'm all the way across the country away from them. They just want to know like I'm in a safe place and safe area. So, I was checking every single day, every single morning to see if I can find a better room that opened up so my parents could feel a little bit more safe with it. So I in, I woke up one morning and I saw that this dorm opened up. Not every dorm here, usually at the Arizona, every dorm is like communal bathrooms. So everyone has to just share a bathroom in, a, in the whole hall and stuff like that. So I saw this one open up and I was like, okay, mom, like let's, let's just get it. And I don't know my roommate. She's actually, I've been talking to her. She's awesome. She comes pretty soon. But um, yeah, so initially I was in a bad dorm. I was in a single room and then I got very, very lucky with this dorm. It's a suite where me and my roommate and these two other girls right next door to us, we share this one bathroom, we clean it. We It's pretty much our responsibility, but it's our own bathroom. Nobody else can go in it, just us. So I just wanted to explain that to you guys before. I'll show you guys my bathroom right now and then I'll show you guys my dorm. So enjoy guys. All right guys, here's our bathroom. So all of us girls have the same exact key. So we were the only ones able to go into our own bathroom. Okay, so here the door is opening and this is what you see. So here's the sink and the mirror. And then to the left of it, you have our shower. It's very nice, it has a nice pull-out. Here's the shower. And then to our left, we have our toilet. And then we have our paper towel thing. So what's really awesome about this is that it's our own bathroom. We can only enter it. And yeah, so I, I kind of held off on decorating the bathroom because I want I wanted to wait for the girls to get here so we can all discuss and see like what do we want and stuff like that. So, all right, so that's the bathroom. And now from outside of the bathroom, we have the main door where you enter. And then we have this cute little like loft space, just like this really big open space where my roommates, like my suite mates, our room is right there. And then you have me and Lily's room. So when we enter the room, the first thing you see is my garbage. <laughs> and then when you walk in, you see her side of the room. As you see, it's like not um, decorated yet because she's not here yet. And so you make it left and this is our first thing. So I bought this thing for us to share. We can put our microwave on top. I got these three bins from, I believe it was Marshall's. Yes, Marshall's. And this Tupperware thing, the six cube organizer is from Target. So in this first one, I have all my snacks. The second one, I have my bowls, plates, utensils, cups, all that stuff. And then the last one is just like cleaning stuff, like paper towels and Ziplocs. Awesome. So this is from Target, and that's what it looks like right now. And then when you go to the right of it, you have our closets. So you have my side of the closet. I have my shoes right here. This is my clothes. And then I just have extra space up there, like Tupperware space for like my hoodies, towels, extra stuff like that. And then I have a long mirror just to see the outfit. And then this is her closet as well, which is right here, which she's not here yet. 
but yeah so that's my closet now when you make your right out of my closet i have this very long mirror and it's not just a mirror i actually got this from target okay so i'm absolutely obsessed with this so it looks like a mirror and then if you open this right here i'm struggling it's a jewelry box so i have containers down there like little storage things shelving necklace holders earrings and then you pull this ring right behind it with a nice led light above it and then right here is all my extra earrings and then just my bracelets my keychain and my mask i'm absolutely obsessed with this okay so right to the right of my mirror from target is my desk here it is so here i have a little nice drawer for my computer i have lots of desk space i bought this mirror from ross it was literally 15 dollars, and it's absolutely amazing i love it and then right here to my right is my makeup drawers organizers whatever you want to call it i got this i believe from ross as well so which is i'm obsessed with it it's it fits everything my mascara is my eyeliner my lipsticks everything and then right here i have these drawers i have a little opener if i want to put some food right here or something like that while i eat on my desk and then i just have my this is my messy drawer as you can see and then this one is going to be my school one and then this one is all my this bottom one is my medicines my extras back there and my lady stuff now to the right of my desk i have this little thing which is from target it rolls out which is super awesome it was super cheap as well so i definitely would say get this it's a must i just have all my hair stuff all my things that i need hairbrushes q-tips everything like that and then i have more snacks under here like the bigger things my cereal my chips all of that and then i haven't really decided what i'm gonna put under there yet but yes so this is from target after this is my bed. So if you guys were curious about these lights, I got these lights from Marshalls. They're super cheap. I think maybe like $10 for them and they're absolutely amazing. Let me show you guys with the lights off. Give me all the lights with the lights off. So back to my bed. This pink blanket I got is from Burlington. It's absolutely, it's so comfortable. And then my comforter, I think we got this from Bed Bath & Beyond. I could be wrong, but it's super awesome. Very comfortable, yeah. Got the pillows. And then I have my nice nightstand right here. So for my nightstand, this nine cube is the exact same thing from Target as my six cube one. So I got this, I got some nice bins, hold some clothes, underwears, some bras, all like the other stuff. I have a cute plant and I just hold my water bottles. A nice thing my mom got me. She also bought me this. It says, for I know the plans I have for you, says the Lord, to give you a future and a hope. So I thought that was super cute. So I put that there and just a little cute plant. So yeah, so this is my kind of nightstand. It's also from Target. So for under my bed, this is what it looks like. My comforter kind of hangs over, so it kind of covers it, which I love, but also love that it shows more of it. So let me show you what's under. All right, so this is what my under my bed looks like when you pull the comforter up. So just to show you guys a little bit, here is my back, my school backpack. Here is my mini fridge. I'm not so sure why my mom bought it, but if you guys are interested, I can definitely ask her. This is the inside. I have a little mini freezer up there. I have all my waters, my fruits and vegetables. And then I have over here to the right, I have my naked drinks and Gatorade, some condiments, and then I have my milk. So yeah, so this is my mini fridge right here and then to the right of my mini fridge is my draw which is the school provides for us i'll show you guys inside but this is what it looks like this is my step up stool to my bed i'm 5'3 so i'm very short 
and it's hard for me to jump on my bed, but I got this super cheap from Bed Bath & Beyond. I actually store some things in it as well. Here's what it looks like. I just have my purses, my heating pad, my hair products, all the stuff that I don't need out, just like hidden and in a good place. So yeah. So that was my step up stool. Now to the drawer, which I just moved this aside just like that. Here it is. So in the top one, it's very compact in here, but just, you know, bear with it. Is my sweatpants, my workout stuff, leggings, all right here. I have lots of lots of leggings. So my black leggings and my colorful leggings back there. Now in my second one, I have, let's see, I have my skirts, my skirts, my soccer shorts, like those running shorts, jean shorts right here, and then biker shorts. So that's what my second drawer looks like. And then my third one is just all my dresses. So I have my rompers, my dresses, more dresses, like the really fancy dresses, my pajamas, my pajama sets that like if I wanna wear, I'll wear, you know, if I wanna feel cute when I go to sleep, I'll wear those. And they're just like my shirts that like I just don't have enough room to hang up. And yeah, and then to the right of my drawer is my cleaning stuff right here. It's a recycling bin, but I have all my cleaning stuff in there. And then my laundry bin. So that was my dorm room tour of my dorm at the University of Arizona. I know it was kind of short because, you know, I only have half of a room to show you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed and got some inspiration or um, got some furniture that you needed and you couldn't find. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you haven't liked the video, like it and subscribe if you haven't. And I hope you guys enjoyed. And I hope to see you guys soon. Bye.